Hey, it's Jeff Grossman, sales engineer for Flu Calibrations Pressure and Flow Product Solutions. Today we're showing you an, a, a demonstration of our piston gauge. In this case, we have the setup where we're doing a fully automated, fully automated calibration of a very high precision pressure controller, a 7250XI, with an automated mass handler. So in other words, instead of having to manually load the mass at each point, which is traditional with a piston gauge, which takes a lot of time and energy, we have an accessory called an AMH, which automatically loads the mass. We have a pressure controller here, which will automatically float the piston once the mass is loaded. And we have calibration software here, which is running and driving the entire test. This calibration software is called Compass for Pressure. We set up our entire test sequence in Compass for Pressure, which points we want to take, how long we want to dwell at each point, how long we want to average points. And then when we're done, it, and it tells us each time, you cannot see here, but it tells us each time, what we're doing. We're waiting for stability, we're waiting for the pressure to uh, get to where it needs to be, we're waiting for the float time, the rotation, then we'll average for a period of time and record that data. And there's no reason why we couldn't take, calibrate multiple instruments at a time if there were multiple instruments of the same pressure range. As you may have seen while we we're talking, previously all the masses were unloaded. When we went to the next pressure point, which is 180 PSI, masses adjusted so that the one mass that we needed to generate or measure 180 PSI loaded automatically. As you see, the technician who was running this test has set it up and has disappeared. He's on to doing something else more productive while well, this entire test takes place in real time with all the values all the, of the results of the measurements here. Immediately after the test is done, it will generate and close a file, a data file and from which you can generate a customized calibration report.